Hey, uh, yeah, so when we were kids, you know, your back-to-school list was like crayons and like a box of tissue paper, but now it's gotten a little more complicated, right? We've got the best gadgets for back-to-school. Our friend Jennifer Jolly, always nice to see you here. New York Times Thank tech you. columnist, also hosted digital series on USA Today. you got some great new stuff for us. I do, I do. Well, let's start with parents' number one question to me. Does my child need a laptop or a tablet, or if they're at college, do they need both? Yeah. Well, you don't have to figure that out, one or the other. You don't have to decide between them anymore because there are incredible gadgets like this little Lenovo IdeaPad Mix 310. This is both. It weighs 20 ounces. That's the same as a Starbucks coffee. Yeah. All right. It's a laptop. It's wow. sturdy. It'll hold up. It's a laptop when you want it. Uh, 10 hours of battery life. Tablet and that when turns you need into it. your tablet. Yeah, and a lot of people are using these and just replacing uh, laptops with these all in one devices. It's incredible. Price tag starts under $300. $300 for the small one, get a slightly bigger one here. This is one of the flagship. This is the Yoga 900S, the thinnest convertible laptop on planet Earth. Incredible elegance with that watch band hinge, rotates all the way around. This starts at $1,000. So this is more, you know, when high school, college, when they need a little beefier machine. Our kids start like eight, what age is starting to bring computers to school now? Well, around, usually it starts in junior high right. or so, and a lot of schools are integrating them into the classes. Yeah. What's really remarkable to me as a, as a tech reporter and columnist doing this forever is that the average age of kids having smartphones now has gone from 12 to 10. Yeah. So you have about what, seven years before? Seven years, my daughter's three, but I mean, the way yeah. I wait, watching her navigate, you know, the iPad is unbelievable, even right. at three, you know. And, so. and we were talking during the break when you are looking at getting your child a smartphone, you're looking at $300, $500, $1,000. I mean, so parents, you're going to have to pony up for a smartphone or have your kids start saving money for a smartphone instead of selling a kidney to afford that. <laughs> uh, take a look at this is Sony's Xperia XA. Um, it's a fancy phone at less than 300 bucks oozes awesomeness on the outside super impressive specs on the inside dual cameras a micro sd support for up to 200 gigs two day battery life two day okay. battery life and wow. it's under 300 for bucks for kids who maybe mowed a lot of lawns did a lot of babysitting they've been saving up a lot more this is sony's x performance xperia x performance and this one's really great because it's not only a, just a magical beautiful phone really great for Form factor, but you can get it dusty, get it a little dirty. It's dust resistant and water oh resistant. So it, it really takes whatever your kids can throw at it and keep on going. And this is incredible because, you know, we're talking about other phones maybe will be uh, water resistant in 2017. Well, they already got there. That's right. And we were just reporting earlier about the new iPhone yeah. that's supposed to be and you got one right here that's uh, right that already ahead of the game. And, and it never gets old dunking it yeah. and having it just be yeah. back to normal you again. Do the selfie underwater and everything. Exactly. Alright, All right, what do you got here? So for fun, this is a water Water bottle. This is called Galulu, and it, it was funded on Indiegogo, ships out on September 1st. Your daughter would love this. Okay. It's a little water bottle that supports hydration with this kind of Tamagotchi character inside. Well, who doesn't so, love Tamagotchi? I know. So it teaches them how to, you know, drink water, yeah, cool. but also play a little fun video game. For older kids, this is a Hydra Smart Bottle. This is the Swiss Army Knife of water bottles. It's a Bluetooth speaker. So you can connect it to your phone and uh, play your music oh from it. Oh my gosh, it does everything. It also charges up your gadgets. It's a light, charges your gadgets. It's and you drink the water inside too. And then okay, it's a water it's, There's bottle. nothing it doesn't. Unbelievable. All right, we got about a minute left, so let's get All through right, the rest of this we'll here. Super wanna, fast. Super... This is where safe. So you have someone going off to college, you're a little nervous about them. Um, my daughter's 15, she goes out running a lot, and in our neighborhood, folks are now uh, mugging people just for their smartphones. So mm. she can't carry a smartphone. She puts this little tag on. If she presses it, you'll feel it vibrate. And it sends a message to her network, so her dad, me, uh, her grandmother, and, and it starts playing audio and shows a location on the map right oh, where wow. they are. So you can listen in without them having to, to try to dig out a phone. Very cool. All right. I don't, and this is free. This gadget's free. You pay five bucks a month for the service. For the service, okay. Yeah. For the service, we gotcha. I still have nightmares that I forgot my locker combo. No more. Since our kids have these smartphones anyway, this is uh, the no key. It's Bluetooth enabled smartphone lock so when you get within uh 
opening distance of your locker. You just press it. Perfect. Dakota Smart Scanner, scan everything. You can edit it in Word. Yeah. Lots of other great things, but you'll have to go to my column. To Fantastic. Read about <laughs> A lot of great stuff here. Fantastic. You can yeah, find fun, Jennifer right? at her New York Times uh, Wired Well columns, also on USA Today's site. Check out there's her blog, jenniferjollyblog.com. She's on the Twitter there, of course. Thanks so much. Thank Always you. nice to see you. Time for Rowntown. Hey, Anna.